so now I'm moving on to all the makeup. Yay! She sent me one of these last time. And it was like um, Fuchsia Flash, I think. It was one that I really, really wanted. Let's see. So it's, it's twisted up. Whoops, wrong way. <gasps> Pretty. Ooh, it's like a, kind of like a wine shade. I like this, thank you. Oh, this is so pretty. Let me see. I wish I wasn't wearing lipstick now, I could totally put this on. Oh, this is such a pretty shade. <gasps> thank you so much, this is so awesome. And it's matte, I love matte lipsticks, thank you. <laughs> it's so pretty. So the next one is Catrice, I love Catrice, yay. I'm thinking it's a lipstick, I'm not sure. It's ultimate day. Let's see. Oops. <gasps> Ooh. You sent a bunch of pretty shades. Can we swatch it? I'll put other swatches like on my blog because you're not gonna be able to really see the swatches from here. We can try. So the top one is the Isadora lipstick, and then the bottom one is this Catrice one. Oh, this is so pretty. It's like a Kind of like a plum shade. Let me see what the name is. Oh, it is. It's a plum. It's called Plum and Base. Ooh, it's so pretty. Okay, so the next one. Rouge Edition Velvet. Okay, hopefully I'm saying this right. It says Bourgeois? Bourgeois? Like that? B O U R J O I S. And it says it's velvet. Oh, I gotta open it. Let's see. <gasps> ooh, ooh, okay. I think you have this on your blog, don't you? You have one of these. Yeah, okay. So Isabella has a blog, like I said earlier. And I remember her, she has these on like a bunch of different posts. This is so pretty. <gasps> I love liquid lipsticks. Let me see. Pretty. It's like a deep red shade, like a deep, like ox blood, I think that's what I would call it. Yeah, definitely ox blood. It's like a really dark red. It's so pretty. Oh, I can't wait to try these on. Yay, thank you. So let's see. Oh, there's another one. She sent another one. It's just like this one, but it's pink. And I know she has one of these on her blog. I'm not sure which one it is though, I can't remember. I think it's this one? Am I right, Isabel? Let's see. Ah, oh, it's a matte finish. Yay. And it's called Pink Pong. Let me see. Ooh, that's pretty. It's like fuchsia. It's like a fuchsia color. Ah, oh, man, these look so nice. Man, thank you so much. These are so pretty. I love these applicators. God, your guys' packaging is so awesome. So let me see. Oh, <laughs> it's so cool. <gasps> Yay, you sent them! <clears throat> so I actually made a request for these because I heard that these are dupes for some MAC eyeshadows. So these are Catrice's um, like single eyeshadow hands. So this first one is called Bring Me Frosted Cake. And I really wanted it. Um, let me see. Oh man, they're so nice. They're like super pigmented. I know this is a dupe for something. Um, I'll put it on my blog. I think it's like MAC Bamboo or Vanilla or something. I don't really know MAC shades, but I'm pretty sure that's what this was a dupe for. So thank you. Then this one is called Starlight Espresso. Yay. I think this is the one I was like really, really excited for. Ah, oh, these are so perfect. Yay. Man, Catrice has really awesome eyeshadows. Yeah, so Starlight Espresso. It's like a matte, um, I'd say like a matte taupey brown. It's definitely cool toned. It's like a grayish brown. It's matte. And I didn't say anything about this one, but this one's like a, it's matte. I'd say beige. Um, I'm thinking it's warm tone. It's like a warm tone beige. And so this other Catrice single. Oh, this is another one I asked for. 
Go Charlie Brown. Ooh, it's a matte. It's like a cool toned matte brown. And it's supposed to be another dupe for a different MAC eyeshadow. I think it's espresso? Something like that. But yeah, thank you so much. Thank you for getting these. I really, really wanted these so badly. These are so pretty. So the next one. Oh, she did send it. She has a review of this on her blog. Yay! Awesome. Thank you so much. I wonder if any of these are in here. No, these look different. Maybe that one? That one looks kind of similar. This is so cool. Thank you. Awesome. Let me see if they have names on it. Oh, oh my gosh, there's an English translation. Absolute matte eyeshadow palette. Six long lasting matte shades that suit anyone and any occasion. Simply a must have. The silky and smooth texture comes in a variety of matte shades from light to dark and can be combined easily with double-ended brush for easy application. Oh, this is so cool. Yay. Oh my gosh, and your guys' brushes actually come with real brushes. Like we, like our eyeshadow palettes usually just come with the like spongy applicators. We never get these things. Awesome. Thank you. Let me see. Do a quick swatch. Oh man, these are really nice. Oh, wow, it's like, just putting my finger in it, it's like picking up so much pigment. Like, I feel bad just rubbing my finger in it, but I'll just, I'll just do it in the edge. Pretty. <gasps> so nice. Oh, man, these are so pretty. Stupid camera turned off. Okay, so there are there's six shades. Um, I think they're all cool toned. They definitely seem like it, except for maybe this one. This one looks like it's kind of warmer toned. Um, and that one might be warm toned too. I'm really bad at picking up on tones. But yeah, there's like um, a taupey kind of brown, uh, a light warm brown, and then a dark, maybe? No, that looks cool toned. And then there's like a really dark taupey shade. But yeah, this looks like perfect, like nude palette. Awesome, thank you. And then, oh, she, this is a postcard. <laughs> she said she was going to send me a postcard, and she's got it. It's one from Amsterdam, because I think she went there, it was like sometime during the summer, I think. Am I right? Not the summer, like September or October. She went to Amsterdam, and she said she picked me up a postcard, and she did. It's so cute. I'm probably going to put this up on my vanity. Thank you. So let me see. Next one. Um, I think it might be a shampoo? I'm not sure. It says, Lovely Mint Story. Um, okay, I'm gonna try, I'm gonna try and do my best German language here. Minze Vertritt Mershan Immer den Kopf und Zubert Furlfans we are nicht. Lila Kocken mit glitzernden Gummis die Form die im Wandschein zum Picknick tippeln. Hopefully I'm saying that right. But there's um there's mint in it and I love mint. Oh my gosh. Let me see. Okay, I'm not sure, but you're gonna have to let me know. Is this like a shampoo or a body wash? Oh, it smells so good. Okay, I'm pretty sure it's like a body wash. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna have to ask you later. Or maybe it's in your letter. I think it might be shampoo or body wash, but I love mint. I have never told you that before, but I really love mint, so thank you. And then, what do we got here? Uh, let me see. Oh, it's Zoeva! <gasps> oh, she was telling me about this. Uh, love is a story. Color, love, and makeup. I think it's a palette. Yay! Let me see. Oh my gosh, this is so pretty. It's like purple and it's got all these 
swirly red thingies. <gasps> this is so pretty. It's an eyeshadow palette. It's so gorgeous. There's all these like neutrals and then it has like a, oh, it's so pretty. It's like a shimmery. I can't even talk right now. This is so pretty. Oh my gosh. Thank you so much. Okay. So it's definitely an eyeshadow palette. It says forgive quickly, kiss slowly, love truly. And it's got so many different shades and I love doing colorful shades and she knows that. Thank you so much. Um, so there's Mystery Day, it's like a dark blue, and then there's Flirt, it's kind of like a navy green, kind of like my shirt. And then there's Old Fashioned, which is, which is like a shimmery purple, Little Kiss is gold, a, like a warm brown shade is over you. Um, oh my god, this color is so pretty, ladylike, this one's called ladylike, it's like a really pretty teal, which is one of my favorite colors. Um, Man with a Plan is kind of, it looks almost duochrome. It's like a duochrome brown with definitely like some red shimmer, I think. Oh, this next shade is so gorgeous. It's called Past Romance. Okay, I gotta touch it. I just really have to. Oh my gosh, thank you so much. This is so pretty. It's called Past Romance. It's like this like really like light purple with like shimmer in it. And this one looks like a satin beige called a fair. And then Film Star is matte, kind of like a matte vanilla color. This is so pretty. Thank you so much. Oh my gosh. I just want to sit here and stare at it. I have to keep going, but I. Ugh, this is so pretty. Thank you so much. I can't even thank you enough. This is so gorgeous. Love story. I've never tried anything by Zoeva, so I'm like really excited right now. And this packaging, oh, this is easily my prettiest eyeshadow palette I have ever owned. Thank you. Oh my god, yay. Okay, let me see. <gasps> she sent me a book. She was telling me about this. So it's called I Heart New York, and it's by Lindsay Kelk. When you're running away from heartbreak, there's only one place to go. And she said she got it in one of her magazines, and that she really ended up falling in love with this author's writing. This is so awesome! Okay, just give me a second, I want to read the back. This is so cute. I am so going to read this. <laughs> I mean, I always say I'm going to read things, but I'm really going to read this. This looks awesome, and I am like a huge Sex in the City addict. I've watched all of the episodes, and this totally reminds me of that, so I'm going to be reading this. Thank you so much. That's another thing that Isabel has gotten me into, is actually reading books again. <laughs> so let me see. So there's Catrice Long Lasting Brow Definer. And I asked for this, I think I did. I remember she offered it to me. But um, she had a, a review of this on her blog. And like, I really love brow products. And I've never heard of this kind of product before. And it's like a, it's a brow marker. And I found out later on that, um, that I think NYX does something similar. So let me see. Oh, that's so cool. Yeah, that's so crazy. I've never even seen a product like this before. So I'll read the description really quickly. Long lasting eyebrow pen with a ultra fine, pleh, pleh, with a ultra fine brush applicator for natural looking and defined brows. That's so cool. Okay, I'm totally gonna use this tonight. This is so awesome. Thank you so much. I like that. Oh wait, in the shade, let me find the shade really quick. Chocolate brown. Chocolate brownie? Yeah. <laughs> okay, I get it. That went right over my head. Chocolate brow knee. Like the food. You get it. <laughs> it's so cute. Let me see. Oh wow, she sent some stuff. Hair stuff. Yay. And it's in a baggie. Let me see. So this one. It's called Bamboo Smooth Candy Oil Pure Treatment Oil. 
Ooh, it's for frizzy hair. That is, oh my gosh. I have that, especially right now because it's winter. Awesome. What kind of oil is it? Kendi oil. I've never heard of Kendi oil. I'm going to Google that. This is so awesome. Thank you. And it doesn't have parabens or sulfates. Crazy. I've never heard of this before. Apply a small amount throughout damp hair and style as usual. Awesome. I'm going to try that out. Thank you. And this one, let me see. Pantene Pro V. Oh, it's more oil. Trocken oil. Mit vitamin E. Vitamin? Vitamin E. I don't know why I said it in a German accent. Quill Sech Avic Vitamin E. Repair and care. Let me see. Ah, there's no English translation. Um, I'm thinking it's like a, an oil treatment for like damaged hair. Let me see. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. Let's smell it. Let's see if I can put a little bit on me. Oh, it's actually clear. I thought it was going to be gold, like, on the inside. So it's like... I'm not sure what the smell is, but it smells good. Thank you! That's so awesome. What the... My hair has been, like, totally out of control and frizzy. Like, this, this, this took a lot of work to get it kind of, like, manageable and presentable. <laughs> so this is, like, really perfect timing because winter is destroying my hair and my skin. Thank you. So the next thing, let me see. It looks like a shampoo sample. Ooh, it looks like it's natural. I love natural stuff. La Vera Natric Cosmetic. Bio, ooh, apple. It's an apple shampoo. That's so cute. I wish I could smell it right now, but I don't want to open it because I, I won't be using it right now. Let me see. Oh my gosh, and it doesn't have any of the stuff that breaks me out. Ah, you're so awesome. Thank you. Cool. It has sea salt in it. I've never used a product with sea salt in it before. I really want to smell it. I really want to open it. I wonder if I can smell it through the package. No, I'll have to wait until I can actually use it. The camera turned off again, but um, so I'm not sure where I left off at, but I was just getting this out, and it's like, it's a conditioner because she wrote on the top, so I didn't have to figure out. Yeah, I didn't have to decipher it. Um, it's like a Pantene Pro-B um, conditioner. Take a sample of it. So I'll be using this and then following up with this. So thank you. That's so cool. And thank you for writing what it was. Because I wasn't sure. <laughs> Ooh. This is the last thing. and Oh my gosh. You are so awesome. Thank you so much. It's a Zoeva brush. It's the one that she was telling me about. It's like... Oh, oh, it's so pretty. Oh, look at it. Oh, awesome. It's the Lux Face Paint one. Oh, it's so soft. This is my softest face brush ever. Oh, I don't want to touch it right on my face. Oh, oh my gosh, thank you. It's like, it's a contouring brush, just to let you know. And what I like about this already is that the brush is like small, because I usually, um, I, like my other brushes are like long like super long and this is like manageable like ah oh, thank you so much this is this is so soft okay i'm gonna have to get more zoeva brushes this is really cool i can't stop touching myself with it it's just so soft ah oh, okay this is funny because i just did um like january favorites on my blog and I was using a Real Technique setting brush <laughs> for contouring because I really like small contouring brushes like this. Like, I wish I had something to compare it to. Um, my pinky, or wait, no, a lipstick. So you can kind of see how like small the brush is, which is perfect because I don't like to do really um, like big exaggerated contours. So this is like the perfect size. Oh my gosh, yay! And like, holy crap, these are so soft. Thank you so much. Thank you, thank you, thank you. But yeah, um, I just got so many awesome things. And Isabel, if you're watching this, thank you so much for sending all of these amazing presents. Like, it feels like Christmas again. Ah, oh, I just love everything. Like, you picked out everything 
like perfectly you have like you are the one that has like makeup like magic you could do makeup magic because you're able to pick out the perfect presence i love it um thank you so much i can't i cannot thank you enough like this is really amazing and i really enjoy doing our exchanges together as i've said before so everybody else that's watching um i will link her youtube and her blog below she's like the sweetest person and you're really going to love her blog and youtube channel like she's very like endearing and she's so awesome thank you isabel so i'll see you guys in another video okay so bye